Hi, it's me. So, you may be wondering what becoming me means. Let me give you a little backstory. I'm a 20 year old college student with multiple jobs. Beyond that, I am a 20 year old person trying to figure out who she is and all that comes with that. Crazy enough, I think for the most part I've got it. Um, But that doesn't mean that there are not areas that I can improve on and there are many areas that I can improve on. And how I see it is improving parts of your life does not mean you need to change who you are to do that. That means that you are going to become the, the the best version of yourself right i'm becoming the best version of myself um actively by doing certain things so that's what becoming me is about it is about me taking these certain aspects of my life that i have really analyzed what are the things that i can fix in my life right now that will aid in me being who i want to be and a realistic version of who I want to be, you know? Not the perfect version of me that wakes up at 7 a.m. every day and eats clean vegan seven days a week and does um, 36 hours of homework every day. That's not going to happen. But, you know, there are a lot of things that I can do to make it so that those things can become a possibility one day. And there are also some things that I want to do because I want them. Like I want to decorate my dorm because I feel like I should live in a space that I like being in. I want to go and, you know, completely switch out my wardrobe because A, I don't fit half my clothes anymore because I am a 20 year old person who uh, no longer fits the clothes that she had when she was a 16 year old. But for some reason, all I have um, are clothes from, you know, freshman year of college. And if they do fit, I don't want to wear those anymore. I'm not 18 anymore, you know? That sort of stuff, right? There are some things that need to be done so that I can just be me. And so that's what this series is about. And so there are three aspects of my life that I decided that I really wanted to focus on, which were personal, like, you know, my personal health, um, mentally and physically, And, you know, the way that I interact with people around me, the way that I interact with myself, the way that I interact with my body, and the way I interact with, you know, the craziness that is happening up in this brain of mine. The other thing is my space. I live in a dorm room. I'm an RA. I have four walls, essentially, and I want to love my room, and I want to get rid of stuff that I don't need, that I don't want, that doesn't add to my life, that's just been here and just sitting and taking up space. Um, I want to get rid of that. I want to bring in stuff that makes me feel, you know, like I want to be in this room because sometimes I don't want to be in this room and uh, it's hard. That's a conversation for another day. And then the next one is style. Uh, As I said before, I am 20 almost 21, and I have gone through some major shifts in my body. I need new clothes, period. But I can't get new clothes until I get rid of my old clothes. So that's what this is. I love having a lot of makeup, I do, but I'm at this point in time now where I don't want to just have lots of makeup to have it. I want to go through the stuff that I have, and I want to, you know, get rid of the old stuff, the (laughs) six-year old tubes of lipstick that sort of thing and you know find you know my one perfect everyday nude lipstick and if that means I'm buying a $34 tube of lipstick fine because you know that's what I want and so that's what I mean by style hopefully this means that I will be putting up six ish videos of me decluttering you know whether it be physical decluttering or like not the three aspects of my life And then adding to those three aspects of my life. Enhancing, doing some switch-ups, doing some change roos adding better habits, making things easier. Yay for change! Woo! I'm excited about it. I hope you're excited about it. 
Um, if you feel like you want to do this too, you really can. It's for everybody. Sometimes I think we need to do a little bit of overhaul, you know, to get to the next step. And so I want to be an adult. I want to be adult Asante. And Asante, who's an adult, does this. I've decided. So um, that's that. And yeah, I hope you're having an amazing day. Um, like, subscribe, leave a thumbs up. My Instagram is at Asante Marie. If you want to follow it, my Twitter link is down below. Thank you for watching. And um, this YouTube thing is actually getting a lot easier. I've only done one video, but like editing is actually not as hard as I thought it would be. Anyways, conversation for another day. Um, have a wonderful day. I will see you in my next video. Bye.